The Adventures of Apne and Teal. Apne and Teal. How does it feel to live in the park on an island? It's just right for us. It's adventurous. The perfect tree. And it's home, home on our island. It was a snowy, sparkly, tingly, twinkly sort of day. Just right for celebrating. Abney was wrapping presents. The Pock Pocks wanted to help. made a space over here. Bring it inside. the perfect tree together. Ooh. So off they went across the snow to find the perfect tree. This is the perfect tree. won't fit under there. There. So off they went again across the snow to find the perfect tree. This one's a bit bigger, Teal. So, off they went again, across the snow, to find the perfect tree. There's the perfect tree. <laughs> oh, too prickly. Oh, yes, much too prickly. Neat decided not to sit on the prickly tree. So off they went again. Aha! Perfect! 
Too tall. Mm. Neep could see all around. He spotted a very good tree. holes in this tree. So off they went again. Hi, Bob. We're looking for the perfect tree to put our presents under. Perfect. Abney and Teal tried decorating Bop's tree. Yeah! Oh, no, this way. Oh, to me. No, oh, no. Bop thought being a bit too wide was great. But we still haven't got anywhere to put our presents. Never mind, Abney. We've still got your house to decorate. Decorating, decorating, decorate, decorate. Mm -hmm. Abney's house looked so wonderful. He made some special celebratory porridge. Thank you. 
The Pox Pox thought it was the perfect tree to put the presents under. That was an adventure, Abney. Yes, it was, Teal. Good night, Teal. Christmas Day. <laughs>